All right, well, we gotta leave them outside the catacombs. I wonder if I'm safe to explore in there. You're here. Good. Sebastian, that relic you mentioned... I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study sarcophagi in this catacomb. From what I read in a report by the student, they weren't permitted to take it with them, so I must assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. I'd be interested to know what else the student discovered. Have a look. Unfortunately, there's no name on it. But I suspect if it was important enough for Slytherin to stash in his spellbook, it's worthy of further study. I'm ready to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we've finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. Good. Ominous would be livid if he knew what we were about to do. If the catacomb was silent, you did more than I imagined learning about her ancestors was illuminating. However, I stumbled upon something else I could not ignore in an area behind a great room which had suffered from decay amid the turned over sarcophagi. I discovered an oddly shaped relic. Immediately, I sensed its power. I would be thrilled to study the relic further if only the removal of the objects were allowed. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. Mm. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just yet. Confusion. At least now we know we're not alone in here. Perhaps that was it. And the rest of the two, insect free. Yeah, the spiders aren't insects. Accio! Don't start. Opening all of these is tempting. Accio! We're here for a reason. I'd say opening them all is justified. Good for you! Accio! Fingardium Leviosa! It's really just all of them. Accio! Revelio! Not to fall. Green's gotta go. Rebellion. 
Finding a chest in an inconspicuous loft. Brilliant. I shall sleep better tonight. Repulsive. Watch your step. I nearly slipped there. Incendio. Accio. I've read about catacombs that underwent expansion efforts and Incendio. ran into problems, often caves, and then were abandoned. Exactly. We'll be fine, though. Rebellion. I want to be buried in. Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur in the sun. Even an altar with a pile of bones. Lovely. Bones outside a sarcophagus. Seems odd. There's something here by the altar. Repairer. Foolishly mentioned the relic in my report and was reminded to leave it where it lay. But research must can come before my fealty to the rules. I sensed something about this relic. I was told that those chosen by English oak wands have powerful intuition. I believe it. Therefore, when no one was looking, I acted. I conjured two barricades to isolate the relic. Ancestors forgive me, but I used their very bones as the key. I plan to return it, but first I must ready myself for our next assignment. Learning the Imperious Curse, the spell said to serve well against enemies. What did you find? Akio! Revelio! Akio! Repairer. Leviosa. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. Repairer. Accio. That's it. Wingardium Leviosa. Rebellion. 
looks onto us. We've made it this far, but clearly we have more to do. Incendio. Incendio. Bastion about the note. So I got two sets of bones in that room. And I got two sets of bones in the other room. Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student's summary referenced the space beyond the Great Room, which means this can't be a dead end. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the bone barricades. I'll look around and see what we missed. Hold on to that diary entry. There may be more to it. It does mention something else. 
It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius curse. Really? Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. There's more to this than even I imagined. Look, bones stacked on you. Hmm. Leave no stone unturned. Or in this case, bone. You've done it. I knew we'd get through. I felt it in my bones. Nice. I guess we know what to do with these now. Rickety Bone Bridge complete. Some of these blues. They're not anything better than what I already have. Before we trudge on further, I've just realized something. 
The student's diary mentions the Imperious Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered. Places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. Focus your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. Game time. Go. Something troubling ahead. Be on your guard. Protego! Stupid one! Imperial! Accio! Incendio! Navioso! Incendio! Defendio! Places! Also! Another barricade! Considering how well you did on the last one, this should be a cinch. Accio! How gracious of you. I try. Accio! Hmm. This looks different than what we faced before. Now we're also dealing with wind storms. You I see why Slytherin's student was so entranced with this place.
Never end. Incendio. Akio. Dead end. Lovely. All that for nothing. Hold on. Don't give up yet. It contains a blend of potential as possibilities of benefit. Not only was it kind, but the world. But the dark sacrifice involved to realize his intent may be too great until we know more. <sighs> Please do not remove this relic. Well, too bad we can. Damn. It looked like they binded three people together. Sebastian, the relic. Look. Could it be? The note and rendition of the relic. It matches. This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea, but we're here for the relic. We should need the relic. I'm willing to ignore what the journal entry says. We're taking the relic. Agreed. This is meant to be. For Anne's sake, I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. I must keep this relic secret, especially from my uncle. follow you. Sebastian, please, leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. How much did you hear? Everything. I heard you encourage Sebastian to take the relic. Sebastian's done his research. He knows what he's doing. Sebastian makes things sound easy when they could be impossible or dangerous. We need to stop him. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. 
I need your help. No Imperial, so yeah. it's a dark sacrifice. What we came this for. Side with Sebastian, we've been silent. Silent with him the whole time. Look at you know what? We ride together, we die together. Bad boys for life. Sebastian's right. We need that relic. I'm sorry. My mind is made up. Are you willing to sacrifice your friendship over this? I might be. How could I choose to stand by and watch him do this? What if the choice wasn't yours? You wouldn't be to blame for what happens. What in the world are you suggesting? Imperium? I don't even know what this is. A... I feel like I'm gonna regret this. That's what I'm saying. I would take all responsibility. This could save your friendship. I know how to cast it. Sebastian taught me. But I won't do it unless you agree. This is insanity. I can't believe you would ask this of me. Sebastian is never going to give up trying to cure Anne. If you try and stop him now, 
will never forgive you. I'm... I... fine. This is unfathomable. But I suppose if you want that responsibility, it may just save what is left of... of my friendship with Sebastian. Remember, this is what I was telling you about the Dark Arts. They come with a cost. You may well regret making this choice. Do what you have to do. Cast it. Before I change my mind. Imperio! Step aside, Ominous. Stay in place until we're out of sight. I will. Sebastian, come on. What did you do? Imperio, it was the only way to get out of here without a fight. Ominous, I'm sorry. Sebastian, we have to go. Did we do the wrong thing? You need the relic. I know. But not like this. Ominous and I agreed. Surely there's a difference between casting Imperio on someone without their knowledge and casting it with permission. I understand what you're saying. I do, but... I've taken full responsibility. You have my word. We've always looked out for each other, Ominous and I. I hope he knows that hasn't changed. How long will the spell last? How long must Ominous stay in the tomb? The curse is lifted already. He'll easily find his way out of the catacomb just as we did. He'll be all right, Sebastian. Get to Feldcroft. I'd rather Anne not know what had to be done to get this relic. She thinks like ominous. It did only upset her. Oh no, this isn't good. What is it? Feldcroft's smoke over there by the hamlet. Let's hurry. Oh, my God. 
What have you done? Saved my sister. With an unforgivable curse. From that damned book, no doubt. Your father would be ashamed. You've gone too far, Sebastian. Stay away from her. From all of us. <laughs> what did my uncle expect me to do? The Imperious Curse saved Anne's life. That goblin was going to kill her. You did what you had to do. If I have to keep proving that to my uncle, I will. He cannot banish me from my own home, from my sister. It might be best to let him calm down a while. May I speak to him? Perhaps I can help to ease the tension a bit. You may be right. Very well. Probably best if I get away from here for a while. I'll head back to Hogwarts. Reparo. How inconvenient travel was before I invented... Leviosa! Akio! What was he thinking? Pardon me, Mr. Sallow. What Sebastian did was inexcusable. You cannot possibly be about to defend him. Sebastian and I have encountered Ranrock's loyalists before. That goblin would have killed Anne. This family does not resort to using dark magic even against our enemies. What Sebastian did cannot be undone. That you are defending Sebastian's behavior at all tells me everything I need to know. You are as guilty as he is. Sebastian is to come nowhere near Feldcroft, nowhere near Anne. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. If I hear that either of you continues down this path, if either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the headmaster immediately. Why, Sebastian? Damn. Rebellion.
crazy. 